Uh, you want to call the police on them for having a barbecue on a Sunday? You're, you're I feel French. Back off! I'm going to tell them there's an African American man threatening my life. So I'm literally shaking right now because I came to a restaurant to shoot content and they just discriminated against me and told me that I'm not allowed to sit down and eat food because I don't have a vaccine card. And I'm just beside myself at the fact that these people right here can say that it's not discrimination. What do you call that? You're trying to do your job. Everybody's trying to do their job. Do you understand what happened in the 1940s in Nazi Germany when people had to pull out cards there? I'm not happy about this either. It's discrimination. Get yeah, get a manager because I'm I have a large following on my account and I'm putting this place on blast. This, it's absolutely ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. You think that I'm going to sit here and allow you to discriminate against me and not say something and not get loud about it? And you're just doing your job? Unbelievable! Everybody's just doing their job. Nobody has balls. Well, I have more video. She's lying about the massive social media following, by the way. All lies. We checked. Here's more. I'm not going to step outside. I'm waiting for the manager. Walk away. Good. Bring the manager. This is absolutely ridiculous. And then to say that it's not discrimination is absolutely more ridiculous. I'm literally shaking right now. So I came out because I wanted to shoot some content for one god. And I came here to have some lunch and then I was going to shoot some content. I was told that this type of place was open. This is the first time that I've been discriminated against since they started this jab card thing. And I don't go out into public because of it. And I came in here and they told me that I can't sit down and I can't have lunch because I don't have a vaccine card. Are you freaking kidding me? And everybody just sits here and has nothing to say. Bunch of freaking weaklings. Nazis, Nazis, sheep, losers. I mean, she wanted to shoot content. How dare this private establishment enforce common sense rules that they are allowed to by law and the Constitution. And by the way, Karen, you are being discriminated against. Discrimination is illegal when it's against a protected class. You do not have the right to simply walk into a store, no shoes, no shirt, no vaccine card, no service is how some companies see it. Okay, um, there's more. Yeah, don't bring your manager out. That's fine. Screw all of you people. Oh my gosh. I gotta get the F out of here. I cannot live in this state anymore. This is what happens when white women are mildly inconvenienced, as my dear brother would say. Okay, uh, let's put up a picture of this Karen. We have identified her. Her name is Morgan Ariel. There she is. All Morgan wants to do is shoot content. How dare they? Dina Dahl, <laughs> as an attorney at law. What Dr. Richie, what were they thinking? Not letting her <laughs> in. <laughs> I don't think she's told no very often. She just seems very upset that she's That's told correct. no. Because she says very clearly, I don't go out much because I know I can't. So, you know, um, and like you said, if she didn't have shoes on, she wouldn't go be able to go in there either. It's a private establishment. They can make the rules they want. You know, Governor Newsom tried to get, they tried to recall him. One of the bigger things that the people who voted against the recall said they were happy with all of the mandates he had instilled. California is one of the strictest states in terms of what they did with the vaccine. People yeah. liked it. Maybe not everybody, but enough. And that's how our country works here. It's a democracy. And really disgusting that she brings in Nazi Germany because she, her business isn't getting you know rounded up. She's not getting rounded up. Her family isn't getting rounded up. She's just getting inconvenienced. So really, how dare she bring that in? Yeah, and they continue to do this. This has become a talking point default theme for individuals who are anti-vax, anti-mask.